Hello everybody. Uh, so I'm going to make a demo, uh, a candle with a Christmas bow and some evergreen here. This is just a, a reference. Yeah? Um, I'm not going to do exactly what I'm looking here. Yeah, so it's just for inspiration. Yeah, I have already sketched it here. Yeah, so or I started the sketching. It's important to understand there is the candle flame here. Yeah, so a little bit like this. And I draw the Christmas ball with uh, all darks yeah, and all, and some details. They are a little bit abstract, but I know that uh, I have some shadows here and light. It's important to follow the, um, the sphere shape. If you if you look at my YouTube channel, there is a, a silver ball with uh, audio, and I explained it about uh, how to paint a Christmas ball. Yeah, um, I'm going to try to make one version with uh, candle and a Christmas ball, yeah? and another version with uh, a candle and some flowers, maybe red roses here yeah it's going to be a second video or it's going to be another video so it's not going to be in the same video if not this video is going to be too long yeah okay so this paper is uh cold pressed 140 pounds this is bow honk this paper cold pressed yeah it's just a uh, tape it um I'm going to start with uh, the candle, yes. It's like burnt sienna, burnt amber, ultramarine violet, yeah, so it's a mixing of all colors. It's not only one, one color. Start adding uh, the candle shape here, yeah, so, uh, and the candle colors. A mixing of burnt sienna, burnt amber, um, a little bit of uh, transparent orange, yeah, so here a little bit, yeah, so I soften a little bit here, yeah, so um, My paper is dry, but I'm adding a lot of uh, water here. Yeah, so I'm going to destroy edges. Yeah, this brush is a uh, synthetic brush yeah so now i'm wet in the background yeah uh, i'm wet in the background so i have the flame here and the close to the f to the flame i have some sort of yellow let me suggest i need to leave some highlights here yeah so the flame is going to pop up yeah it's almost the white of the paper here yeah and then as it is wet here, yeah, I can add more darks, yeah, a darker color now, more ultramarine violet and the burnt sienna, yeah. So they are here and I can use a little bit of queen magenta, yeah, so, and the mixing on the paper, yeah, so dark, dark, dark. Uh, all these darks, they're going to make the candle pop up. Yeah, so a little bit like this, yeah. And then I can soften here, yeah. So I'm going to have some highlights here. An interesting highlight here. Yeah. So Queen Magenta, Burnt Amber, Burnt Sienna, Ultramarine Violet, yeah. So. Uh, I'm mixing on the paper. Yeah, you can see that I'm mixing on the paper. Yeah, and here it's not the white, white, white. I can just uh, blend a little bit or bleed. All pigments they are going to bleed a little bit here. I want a soft edge. Yeah, so let us see. So here there is. A little bit of this, it's a very faded 
uh, color here, very just uh, some sort of uh, burnt sienna with a lot of water. Yeah, so. And I can enhance this light here, just softening. Um, I still can come back here and I can add more darks because as the pigment is drying, it's going to fade. Yeah, so let me add more burnt umber and the ultramarine violet or some shade of blue. Yeah, dark blue here. Yeah, so and blue there. I want more shadows here, so. Let me blend. let me mix background and the candle here. Yeah. So good. Okay, so coming back to the candle. Yeah, I'm softening edges, yeah, so and uh, let me soften edges here. can keep on adding more darks here yeah, so then darks a few darks I'm working wet on wet here mm -hmm. darks yeah so a little bit of orange a little bit of red Winds are red, yeah, so, and I'm softening here. Mm -hmm. And then let me soften here. You can add more yellow here, a little bit of yellow, yeah, there. Then let me soften here. It's like a creamy white here, not the pure white. Then I can soften here a little bit. So More darks here. And then I can come back later, but it's time to start uh, uh, the Christmas ball. So using the mixing of uh, winter, winter red, yeah. And a little bit of um, uh, permanent alizarin, so I'm going to start suggesting this sphere here. Yeah, so this sphere is here. And then here too, yeah, so I'm softening. Yeah, I'm respecting the sphere. Yeah, that's why I'm adding pigment following the sphere. Then I'm adding a little bit of this shade of brown here because I think that uh, there are some reflections. This is a reflective surface. Yeah, so. And then let me come back and let me fix the the shape here. Yeah. Um, and I can start adding all these darks here. Yeah, I have some darks here, so let me start. Mm, this is shadow violet, yeah, so 
a little bit of shadow violet and uh, permanent alizarin, yeah, a little bit here. And uh, I do this, then let me soften and clean my brush here. So, and the more pigment here, yeah, so. Let me lift here some highlights. And then I come back here, let me work with uh, the ball shape. Uh -huh. And then darks here, yeah? just to suggest uh, the volume, yeah, so. Uh, okay, I can come back later here, yeah, so I want to suggest uh, some greens, evergreens here behind, yeah, a little bit of greens, yeah. I don't want to show the reference a lot because I change the reference a lot, yeah, so I don't copy the reference, yeah, so, and I don't want that you, that you try to reproduce exactly, or you try to paint exactly what I painted, yeah, I want that you make your own version, you don't need to use the same colors or the same composition, and it, it can be, it can be good, also good, or, yeah, so, and then uh, I suggest something green here, just to, a little bit, yeah, so uh, I use the tip of my brush just a uh, little bit like this, yeah, so I have more darks here and darks here. So so Then I can come here, yeah, so. And add some background. It's a little bit of Indian yellow here. And then I can start adding some darks here. Um, it's the uh, the bow shadow, yeah. So here a little bit, yeah. So uh, this is French ultramarine and the burnt umber, yeah. So yeah, you can do this, yeah. Like this. Then let me come here. I'm trying to fix this fear. Yeah, anyway, I can do it later. Yeah, so then darks. Darks here. So let me add more reds here yeah so uh it's the same winter red yeah so but uh, with more pigment here uh, then more reflections here so A little bit like this, yeah. It's 
darker here. This is ultramarine violet, yeah. So some highlights here. Uh, so. And then I can lift out and I can suggest more highlights here. So let me come back here and add more darks. Yeah, so darks here. They can suggest something that looks like um, stems or any any way. Yeah, I, I don't need to identify everything. Like, oh, I have this. And then let me come back here to the to the candle, yeah, so and let me suggest more and more. Uh-huh. Then I just came back here and I'm adding more yeah, yellows here. Mm -hmm. And darker, a darker color here so uh, I can show uh, that the light is here. Yeah, so that's why I'm adding another layer here, a darker layer of uh, rats or yeah so uh -huh. and darks darks here uh -huh. so now let's check uh, everything here yeah so um So darks here to emphasize. Now I'm going to do this the, where I hang my Christmas ball. It's here, yeah. So just uh, something like that. 
fast a little bit yeah And I can suggest this, yeah, it's more or less uh, this, yeah, so like a little bit, yeah. Now a few darker touches, yeah, so uh i'm adding more pigment yeah it's transparent orange and burnt sienna and i can suggest that uh, uh, there is something like this here just uh, and here too yeah so So something like that, and then here I mix more, yeah. Just uh, some highlight or some texture here and even here like this, yeah. So I'm lifting a little bit here, yeah. So a um, few more darks here. Let me see if I need more reds here, yeah, maybe. So more pigment, so this highlight is going to pop up. And here, yeah, darker. I can finish, yeah. The main thing is done here. I can just... Uh, something like this yeah so um hope you have enjoyed yeah so happy holidays merry christmas don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel turn the notifications on so every time i add a new video you are going to be you are going to receive a notification or something like this yeah so now i'm going to make a one more version um another version with candle and uh flowers yeah it's going to be the next video just uh, look for the next upload a candle with uh, red roses yeah okay so thank you very much once more see you soon bye bye